Hello, welcome to 1995 Batman.com. Today we are looking at this essential purchase of the uh, Eraser collection from Noteworthy. <laughs> this is something, uh, a guy reached out to me on Instagram and was like, hey, I have these erasers from Batman Forever. Do you want them? I'll sell them for a really reasonable price. Um, I was like, hell yes. Um, so I'm going to open these up and have a look at these. I haven't opened these up yet at all. They're still in the packaging. Uh, I debated whether I was going to, but I think for this video I might as well. Um, so just going around the back, uh, it's all the same on the back. As you can see, I have only three I'm missing. They did Batman, Robin, Riddler, doing a very kind of sassy, kind of like hand on hip, kind of finger out. <laughs> and then they also did another Batman with his with his kind of fist raised in the air. I don't know why they didn't do the Two-Face. Whether that was, I don't know whether Two-Face is maybe a, a pain in the ass to do because he's got kind of like the two sides, is, there's a lot of paint, you've got to try and do all the zebra stripes and stuff, maybe that was just kind of like, ugh, forget it, I'd rather just do Batman all in black, or Riddler all in green. Um, so let's open these up and have a look, because uh, yeah, I've seen these for a while and I've been excited to try and get them. Okay, so first up we got Little Batman. <laughs> Very cool. I think they've done a pretty good job actually of this, uh, all things considered. Like his cape is kind of stuck to his legs, it's not, it's not, yeah. Um, but all in all, I think that's not too bad actually for the scale. Look, they've got the little ridges on their head and the big bat symbol. I think that's okay, I think that's pretty good. Um, face, it's okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. Uh, okay, next up, let's do the Riddler, which is, again, like, I think for the scale, like, what what are we looking at here? Like, one, two, three, four, like, maybe five centimetres high? I think that's pretty good. Like, they've done they've done the shoes where it's kind of like a belt buckle uh, kind of thing. You can see, like, his uh, whatever green, green bits underneath. Uh, the question marks are a little bit uh, half-assed. And, oh, they have done round the back, though. That's surprising. Because even Kenner, sometimes, when they did uh, Riddler figures, were just like, ah, do we have to do question marks on the back? No one's going to see that. But they have, which is very cool. Obviously, uh, yeah, they don't look like the question marks in the film, but I think all in all, that's, that's not too bad. He's got the old uh, red gloves that he wears very briefly in the film. And they have done the... Whoops, sorry, Batman. And they have done the red hair round the back. Uh, so yeah, all in all, I'm very impressed with that. I don't know how well he's going to stand. Oh, all right, actually. And then lastly, we're going to do Robin, which, ooh, a bit trickier to get out. In this very cool kind of like, no, no, why, why, God, why, uh, kind of pose. Um, again, I'm I'm super impressed. Like considering this is an eraser for like rubbing out pencil marks. That's sorry if I didn't make that clear at the start. That's that's what these are for. Like they've done the little notches all the way down. They've done the oh, I can't know if you can really see because the focus is going going onto the riddler. Uh, if you can see the they've done the R uh, on its chest. And one thing I've noticed is they've actually changed it. So like on the back it's just got the um, the old uh, the old concept art. Oh, I can't really do it. The old concept art where he's wearing the big kind of triangle mask, but then here they've actually made it look like the the movie. They have done it obviously in green, and he he had a black mask in the film. But and he's got some very bouffant hair, considering Chris O'Donnell had very kind of short hair. Um, but yeah, they're giving him the sideburns. I'm just gonna have a look for the earring. I don't think they've got the earring. They could have done that, guys. Come on, because I can see they're trying to use like. Uh, the the yellow, green, red. Okay, right. So we will just use those kind of color palettes. They could have just done a dot for the for the earring guys. Uh, obviously, he's got the black boots and the green gloves, as he does in a lot of kind of merchandise. Uh, maybe that was part of the concept art. Uh, you know, early on, that's what they thought the suit was going to look like. Um, but yeah, ooh, does he stand. He doesn't stand too well. I might have to. There we go. Go on, stand, stand. Yes! Right, so there you go, that's the eraser set uh, from Noteworthy. Uh, definitely get these if you can.